Good morning. Another beautiful spring morning. Just uh, returning from a bit of a stroll along the beach and this fellow wasn't here before. And as I said, it's amazing the stuff nature throws at you when, when you keep your eyes open. Have a look at the size of this um, starfish here, or sea star if you like. I don't know if uh, it's alive. I'm going to toss it further out into the into the water again, though, as I do with all things I find, living creatures or that may not um, show up really how big that is on this. But let me just zoom in a bit first and show you the. You can see the bristles that it walks with along each arm. There's uh, lots of them. Really sort of millipedal kind of uh, look to it. The skin on it, or well, the patterning, reminds me of uh, a lace monitor. It's, um, it's got to be easily 12 inches across. So I'll put something there, like my hand, to give you a rough comparison of how big this starfish is. Look, washing up a bit closer now. Here's my hand, fully outstretched. I've got fairly long fingers. And, uh, a lot of guitar players and so on there. But look at that. That's a, that's a monster. I've never seen one so big. It's beautiful. It really is, really is a magnificent specimen of sea star. Um, I call them starfish. Call them what you will. That's a beauty. I just thought of something too. We've got seven, seven legs, or arms I should say. Reminds me of the seven-pointed star on the Aussie flag. That's symbolic. <laughs> If anyone knows exactly what sort of, uh, what name this guy's got, if there's any um, marine biologists out there, let me know. Because that really is wonderful. I'm flying back out there. See ya.